Alright, so here we are back at this game again. Uh, but for a little while, because I have a physical uh, cartridge on my GBA, I've been practicing these stages quite a lot. So hopefully I should be able to blast through the rest of this world without any serious problems. I really hate it when that happens. Okay. I hope it's a breeze comparison to um, uh, what I played on the Game Boy. So, Death Flutter Dash 10 for thank you for following. Or 104. Wait, I don't know if that's a hosting or not. It just shows, like, the entire username. Oh, no! Ah. Oh. I miscalculated my distance. Golden, I see 13 stars and I am disappointed. What do you mean 13 stars? Uh, the barbecue yesterday was good. In fact, um... My brother, uh, has a girlfriend and every now and then they live together. Um, there's still a little bit of a debate between the two of whether or not they'll be, um, long story short, she found out my YouTube channel and, um, I'm not going to say her name, but she does have kids and she has a daughter and she likes watching my YouTube channel. <laughs> I was a little nervous about that because whenever it comes to my parents or any close relatives, it ke I tend to keep things at a low profile because I'm always, uh, I'm always nervous about how they feel about me being an online content creator. Like, for the most part, my parents approve of me being a content creator, and they know that it makes me happy with whatever it is that I like doing. But my family has also been on the strict side, in which I'm not going to say too much about that because I don't want to risk demonizing anyone. No! Damn it! Why didn't you drop the key? Um, I don't know how old she is. I've seen photographs. She looks like she's like six or seven years old. <sighs> Damn it, that was stupid. I wasted my time doing that. And I completely screwed myself up. Understandable that you uh, would be nervous about having an, being an online content creator. Anyone would be. I know it sounds counterintuitive to say that when you compare, um... Showing things to your close relatives towards what you're showing online because it's a bigger audience when you're showing uh, stuff to um, to a lot of people who are easily going to access and watch it online. Oh, at least I made it on the platform. All right, let's get this gift here. Hit the blue switch now because I stupidly miscalculated. Uh where to land on that platform and got my ass electrocuted last time. Alright, drop and let's see. I don't want 10 or 12 year olds swearing. I really don't. I started doing like I started to cuss when I was around 12 years old and you can blame junior high for that because everybody else started cussing. Oh, hello Simon Lane. At the end of the day, it's a job that can go away in a heartbeat. Um, it can be if you're not careful. Just like I got my ass electrocuted. Middle school is horrible for cussing. See, unfortunately, nightfall, this day and age, that is impossible. Yeah, you know, with all the kids playing, uh, you know, Call of Duty and Halo and Gears of War. Let's see. I cussed at age one or maybe younger at the store. I said shit at the store at that age. You remember that? That's impressive. Alright, let's go over here. Let's activate the switch. Let's see, no, my mom told me. Your mother told you to say shit when you were a year old? Um, I don't know how to feel about that. Maybe we should stop asking questions so the golden can focus. I can, I can still take on questions. I mean, it's something to keep the stream occupied instead of just going through just gameplay with no commentary. 
Come on, grab this key, chuck it over there, and grab it again. Activate that switch. And drop down here. Drop it this time. Okay, jump and get it. There we go. She told me the story. Who told you the story? Oh. Let's see. Favorite anime? Uh, Studio Ghibli. Oh. Uh, let's get you over here. Grab that. Okay, this part is a little tricky. It's doable, but you have to be a little patient. Oh, damn it! Like I said, you have to do... You have to be patient. TLK review is for a 20th anniversary. Going to do a review of TLK? The Lion King? Uh, Lion King is more than 20 years old. It's going to be 25 next year. Um, I've had some thoughts about reviewing Studio Ghibli films, but given the copyright system and how much of a stick up an ass that, um, that Studio Ghibli has, I don't want to take the risk, uh, right now. LK2. Oh! Um, I'm actually gonna review that as part of a marathon that I've... Well, Sam, you know about that. Um, I was gonna do a marathon over the summer. Um, I'm trying to find the right time to work on it compared to other projects. I want it done around June because that's when the first movie came out. But yeah, I am aware um, that Lion King 2 came out 20 years ago. Um, trying to multitask here. But no, um, I'm going to be saving that for the marathon with the other um, other entries. Like, um, uh, what was it? Like, there's one and a half, and there's there's the pilot of the Lion Guard. God, with that that pilot movie sucked. Let's see, for the twenty fifth, um, yeah, it's most likely going to come to that. Like, that wasn't even my intention. The biggest fear that I have is that. There's one of two things. Because they're making that live-action remake, Disney would be, like, territorial with their copyright system. Like, even then, I can still, like, fight with copyright claims and um, still file fair use. The other of which, some people would, would probably assume that I would be in support of the live-action movie, which I am not looking forward to. They really shouldn't be doing that. Oh, damn it! In Lion Card's defense, it's a preschool. That's the problem! It shouldn't have been preschool. Lion King has been known to be for a general audience, not, f like, not for toddlers. You turned Lion King into Teletubbies. That was a really dumb marketing strategy. They kind of did retcon uh, Kiara's character. And I keep getting hit. Like, in the first, um... Well, not the first, but... In the original sequel, she said she didn't want to be queen, thinking that it's not fun. And yet, in the Lion Guard pilot, she's all up for being a queen. It's, it's the complete opposite. Damn, I almost fell in the pit. Didn't mean to drop like that. Oh, come on! Are you fucking serious? Is it? It's weird to hear Kovu could combat out of that cub. Well, when you do put things into perspective, uh, Zira had plans on teaching, uh, training Kovu, supposedly to kill Simba. So I think it would make sense, uh, you know, playing the devil's advocate. Um, as for the series itself. I really don't have as big of an issue. By comparison, it's like night and day. What is best duck from Disney? Scrooge McDuck? I don't know. Uh. Oh, no. There we go. There we go. Grab that. Drop on that shy guy. Let him turn around. And hello. Is that Dever? 
Yep. Yep. Hey, how are you doing? I'm doing fine. And how up? Eh. And how great I got to catch you back in Mario vs. Donkey Kong. <laughs> well, lucky for you, I was able to, um, I practiced this game on my Game Boy Advanced. Lucky for me or lucky for you? Because of your sanity. Uh, lucky for me. No, people were asking me questions about the Lion King. Like, I'm one of those people who really do not like Lion Guard, and I'm not looking forward to that live-action remake. Lion Guard, I just like, why? Just why? The pilot, like, the pilot was complete garbage. I fucking hated it. I'll be honest, I haven't seen anything beyond the pilot, and that pilot was just... It's like yeah. The yeah. Oh yeah, no, yeah. that left me such a sour impression that I didn't even bother to see the series. Then everybody else said the series was better and that you really ought to give it a fair chance. To me, whenever there's, like, anything that I give something to for the first time, and if it does not impress me very well, I'm I'm not going to have much faith with it. It's like, the pro it's like, yeah, you should give things a chance, but the first chance you get should be at step one. I'm tired. I'm kind of tired of this idea that, oh, you should, even, even if the start is bad, the rest is bad. And, like, I don't really like that. No, like, that's that's something I would say about Gumball, because a lot of people have been saying, oh, uh, the earlier episodes are not that good. It's like, well, then maybe you should spend a little more effort on your scripts. Oh, I would recommend these episodes. And if you're going to have to watch some selective episodes, I'm sorry, but I, I cannot accustom to that. I mean, when it comes to watching a series, I want to enjoy this series, not individually selective episodes. That's That's pretty stupid. Because it's cutting too much slack off of the writers and the people behind it, depending on whatever it is that they make. I know, like, the first season is not going to be the best, but you should strive to make sure your first season is the worst by default. Because the rest is so good. But you still should make it so your first outing is still a good first impression. Because first impressions are everything. You mean, uh, you mean Gumball or, like, the standard of TV any, 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 Anything. Standard. Yeah. I, like, okay, I do understand that. Like, the first season of anything, you're going to go through trial and error. But if it's still entertaining, I think that would be good enough. Yeah, but, like, th those first episodes are crucial. No! no! Damn it! I was too slow. Let's see what happens when the stream catches up. Let's see. Oh! <laughs> that was a shocking experience. And I got myself squashed. I jumped down too soon. Let's see. Well, I am in the mood for some pancakes. Do you like waffles? Do you like waffles? Do you Shut like pancakes? Shut up now! Or I will murder you! What, do you not like that song? Well, it reminds me too much of another thing. Another thing? Let's just say it, it involves three letters. And a one of the trends of these oh my god why reboots. Come on, you should be able to figure it out. So three letters and that pancake song. Fuck! Three letters, that song that happens to involve a certain food, and horrible reboot. Pan? No, T Titans Go! TTG. Oh. Cause that fucking... Wait, that show uses that song? No, they had a whole episode where they just had Cyborg and Beast Boy say nothing but waffles the whole episode. Oh. You see what you did, Teen Titans Go? You gave breakfast a bad name, piece of shit. You, you never heard of that piece of... I never watched that show. I've only watched, like, the first episode. I didn't bother with the rest of the series, especially given its I've, reputation. I've, see, I've just heard of it. Like, I, I didn't want to give it any attention either, but I just... I just keep hearing about just from the people I subscribe to, just how, what the fuck that show's done. <sighs> Waiting for that electric spark to go by. Any second now. Do 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 do. Free, cursey TTG. 
Okay, so I saw no spark there. But there's a spark right around there. Okay. No! Oh, I told you to grab that pole. What the dick? You wanted to like Teen Titans Go? Okay. You gotta hold up when you're... Make sure you hold up when you're falling like that to grab on. I the... was holding up. You, get your ass over here. It's... No, like, the only episode I watched is that one of the characters is, like, supposedly a Pegasus sister and watching some, like, some kind of MLP spinoff. Like, that's the only thing that I can remember. I didn't bother with the series. Our logic is here, I think. I As much as I like the original Teen Titans, I don't think it really needs to be continued. Like, even though there was still a lot of, like, what happened at the end of the last season, uh... There wasn't really any more questions that needed to be answered, aside from, like, what was going on with Terra. Okay. Let's see. Swing. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, God! Fucking damn it! I thought it was going to appear on the other end. <laughs> but, because, let's face it, like, unless it's, like, the Samurai of Jack reboot, revi rebooting or reviving anything is kind of dangerous these days. Oh yeah. Not only, we got, not only do we got like Teen Titans Go, we got that Ugh Titans TV show. <sighs> Fuck Batman. <laughs> Fuck Batman. Now it's my turn to make that garbled voice. You know, hey, <laughs> here's what I have to say though. You wanna know how that would have worked, this TV show? What? Dead it in the Injustice universe. I'm dead serious. Then you, then that would make perfect sense. Whoa, Jesus! Oh, oh, that was a close one. Jesus, Logic, I, I agree with that too. It just feels like they're just trying to hold like people's demands behind like a, like um, a movie they probably don't even want to pay for. Fuck! It's like, oh, you want us to give attention to this thing? Give attention to this shitty thing first. Oh, okay, I was better at uh, this. Nick Zilla, I don't think Vegas XLR would be able to be made to stay unless it was on Adult Swim. Uh. That was a close one. Didn't mean to even drop over there. Alright, push me over here, grab that pole. All right. That was a close one. All right, wait for this spark to go by because it goes in the opposite direction. Come on. Come on. Damn it, I wasn't high enough. Fuck. Thought I could like swing and jump over that. Come on, turn your ass over here. And there Let's we go. do a quick count. Like, what is the only? What are the only good reboots that we've had recently? There is Samurai Jack, Ducktales. Um, I can't think of anything else. I'm not gonna count MLP because they've already did a thing with the that. Was, that was that was years ago? Yeah. Like we're talking about like. But I'm talking. But I'm even then though. It's like um. Let's see. Son of a bitch! Come on. Let's do reboot slash revival because technically semi drag is a revival continuation. Yeah. Oh, I missed it. Damn it. But then what else? What are the bad ones in recent memory? We got um, Teen Titans Go, Powerpuff Girls, Ben 10. Now recently, Rainbow Bright, then oh, Thundercats Jesus. too. Jump, jump! Oh, oh, oh! Holy crap! Okay. Ah, <sighs> okay. Oh wait, I remember this trick. You gotta swing a little bit and keep jumping to the right and keep jumping. Yeah. Move a little faster than just crawling along. Gotcha. All right. Yes, I got one of the little guys. All right, so a little bonus game. 
All right, let me see if I can do something with the uh, the yellow one. Oh, it's one of these. The arrow ones are like, those are a piece of cake, but when you have to swap them around and avoid the, the giant fist of Donkey Kong, it's, it's almost it's impossible almost because it goes way too fast when you're down to two. It's basically just 50-50. Yeah. Oh yeah, Voltron's a good one. I've heard about Voltron. Oh, fuck this one. Okay. I know what I have to do. Here we go. Jumping on the platform. Over the set of... Set of blocks where that door is. Grab that. Because if I don't, I'm going to go right up the spike ceiling. And that's going to lead me to my doom. Drop on that platform. Okay. All right, duck. All right, and... Nope! Ah, oh, there we go. Right on the switch. Let this trash can walk across the spike pit. All right. I gotta wait for this platform to drop. Bingo. Oh, no. Oh, that was close. All right, drop here. All right, cool. <clears throat> All right, cool. I managed to go through that one like nothing. I remember playing Donkey Kong 94 as a little kid on the real Game Boy. Donkey Kong 94. And on Game Boy? You mean Donkey Kong Land, or...? Alright. Oh. It's this stage. This requires a little bit of patience. Haha! -ha. Alright, get away from the next bob bomb by the way, it, I always found it weird how they decided to put use the sounds of the ball bombs in this game because they sound like robots. Like, wow, they die. I guess that's the point because they're, you know, they're little toys that just, like, tick around until they explode. Yeah. Oh, no! Oh, god damn it. I dropped way too soon. Ugh. Now I got to do it all over again. Fuck. I'm sure that jolted you awake. Boo! No! Oh! Come on, Brett. You practice these multiple times. How are you fucking this up? All right, let's get this bob bomb over here. Come on, Chad, you don't like my puns? Do you find them revolting? <sighs> God damn it. Got hit by a fucking wrench. <sighs> Let's get this bob bomb over here. Get, pick him up. Come on. Oh damn, that was a weird maneuver. Had him flip on his hands and then back on his feet again. Huh. Well, I guess that's one less thing to deal with. All right. Now I can drop, get over here. But I really got to... Whew. 
All right. There we go. Fuck! I gotta do it all over again. God damn it. I told you to duck! What the fuck? That's bullshit. I knew he wanted a little off the top, but he forgot it was electricity and not. I think this is, that's a weird thought that we've seen Mario in so many outfits, but we've never seen him bald. Oh, god damn it. Weird Manova? What the hell is Manova? Manova. Yeah, what? Manova? Manova? What is that supposed to be? Son of a it's bitch! Not, and that's spelled we, we're red. Manova, not weird. Magical Star, if you're turning my swearing into a drinking game, you're gonna kill my entire audience. I could just sense the liver scream in an agony. Where do you become the demo man where water is poisonous to you? The demo man? Yeah, from TF2. Oh. Well, I just realized I gotta take care of the next set of blocks. Sometimes the responding system can be a pain in the ass. Actually, you gotta, yeah, for the bombs, you just gotta step away from the pot, otherwise they won't All come right. out. Yeah, it's kind of dumb like that. But then again, there are some situations where being, uh, like, being close to it in a situation where you gotta be close to work on something. Run. Okay. Ah, oh, fuck. I remember this part now. Okay. It's gonna have a little bit of patience, but I can't wait too long. Okay. Come on. And. Fuck! Now I gotta go back. I would have laughed if you blew yourself up at that bomb. Son of a fucking bitch! Did, did, did that exactly just happen, or... Oh, no. No. Uh, oh, <laughs> <laughs> Misery loves its company. Get your ass over here. Okay. I only drink hard mic lemonade. Huh. Yeah. All right. All right. And now I can drop. I can go over here. Move away from that ball bomb because I don't need it. Ugh, that stupid shy guy throwing his damn wrench at me. I I think that's a, I think that's given how shy guys are named, I think he's called a wrench guy. Well, okay, that's the appropriate nickname. All right. I meant maneuver, but Google didn't correct it for me. Oh. You know, it's weird. Autocorrect is there for, like, any grammar errors, and yet... Son of a bitch! I was right in the same spot where I got killed! Vaporeon, I'm with, um... De uh, it's Dever who's with me on the stream. Stream. Excuse me. If you're wondering who I am, I don't blame you, because I was never active in the running community. You were there, like, every now and then, but, uh, we remember you closely, mostly with, uh... God fucking damn it! <laughs> Cards Against Humanity and the spoiler joke. Because that used to piss you off so much. Yeah. 
I was more of like a hanger on than an actual contributor. So pussy. Hi, uh, Solar. Or is that Master Code? Solar. Yeah, yeah okay. definitely Master Code. By the way, speaking of cards against humanity, did you hear that the place we used to hang out doing that pretend you Ziggy closed down? I've heard about that. I thought it went back up or something. Apparently, uh, it doesn't seem That's like it. That's unfortunate. It is. I mean, Cards Against Humanity, like, I don't play it as often, but god damn is that hilarious. Yeah. At the very least, I got a Jackbox party on Steam, which, by the way, folks, uh, donation goals. At 100, I'll do Earthworm Jim. At uh, 200, I'll do Mario Brothers 3. And at the full donation, I'll do Super Mario Brothers The Lost Levels. And upon doing so, I can create a separate, um, I can create a uh, separate stream time where a lot of you can get involved in Jackbox Party. Because so I got Gespionage, Quiplash 2, and, um, Murder Trivia Party. Oh, so you ran into a laser. Haha. <laughs> Again. Thank you for pointing out the obvious. Oh, Are yes, it's quite... Tell us that we're being affected by gravity. <laughs> it's, it's shockingly obvious, right? Yeah, really. Oh, come on, that was worse than mine. Yours is just terrible no matter what. Exactly. <laughs> I'm past 100. Wait, some people are saying I'm at 129. You are. I'm looking at the stream right now. How the fuck? Well, wait a second. Okay, this is weird. Let me, let me reload this. It still says 35 on the window. What the hell? How did I get to 129? Apparently some... 129. I don't know. I don't know how much you have. I have to... Then, so. This is this is odd. I don't know how I managed to get that far up there. Let me check my PayPal because... It still says 35 on my end. I Check your Apple. Yes, I have to check my PayPal. This would be a good time to call this an episode, and uh, I should be able to check.